Alrighty guys, welcome back to Zerif Plays. We're going to be continuing on with Hollow Cocoon. So sit back and enjoy. Alright, so. Last episode we did that, so we're going to go through here. Let's see where this takes us. More yen, yay! Alrighty. Oh, why do we have to go down? This is fucking creepy, dude. Hello? Whoa. I don't like how that opened. Hello? Like a fucking dungeon, dude. What the fuck? I'm gonna try and be very thorough with our searching. Lord Kube, please forgive me. I've seen nothing. I've told no one. My lips shall remain sealed. I promise to serve the Miyama family forever and ever. So please let me leave this place. Fuck. I too am a human being. Please do not use my flesh as a meal for that creature. What? Oh, dude. Man, this is really, really creepy. It's so dark. Okay. Ooh, another safe spot. I guess that means that something's about to go down. It's getting me saved right there, and there was also a save down there. What the fuck was that? Hello? Ooh. It's a fake wall. Shit, okay. Hello? It's another save thing, what the hell? The red talisman is a protective charm used to in the region from ancient times. It's made by dyeing paper with the crimson colour, believed to be believed to repel demons and drawing symbolic characters in black ink. The exact meaning of the symbol is unknown. It is speculated that they represent the sun deity, as sunlight is believed to purify the negative energies. According to the village legend, when a demon approaches the talisman, it immediately emits a radiant light, torturing the demon as it's exercised. Oh shit. <laughs> Okay. 
なんだよこの札は頭が割れそうだ You're a demon bro That's her Dude, she's right there. Let's go. Fuck that, man. Yeah, I'm a family tree. Flint, an ignition tool. Used by hitting with a hammer and stone. Miyama Yasuki. Koko wa Miyama ke no kyutaku ka. She's gone. Oh no 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 no. I need to run in there. <gasps> run, 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 Please fucking no. Knew it, dude. I heard her run out. Something floating on the murky water. Okay, I need some kind of like hook or bucket. This is creepy as fuck, not even gonna lie. I'm actually on edge. Oh, dear mum, it has been several months since dad passed away. Not a day goes by without a box of tissues by my side. When I came to offer my condolences, I couldn't come to terms with dad's death. I couldn't even speak to you, mum. Why didn't you tell us right away? 
you didn't even invite our family to the funeral if we hadn't reached out you would have you wouldn't have bothered to tell us at all dad was an important role model for me i wanted to give him a final farewell Dude. It's locked. There's a crowbar carved in the lock. Okay. in the floor are covered with boards. I can see a room below through the gaps between the planks. There's something on the desk. Fucking hell, man. This is really creepy. <sighs> Alrighty, let's head down. Holy fuck. I need firewood, okay. What is she doing? I'm afraid to move, man. What do I do? <gasps> I knew I shouldn't have done that. She chased me. Oh my fucking god, she's so fast. Oh, holy fuck. Let's try and uh, 
find some firewood, I guess. Oh dear, oh dear, what should I do? I've gone and lost the key. I had it with me before I went to the toilets, but somehow I managed to lose it. If anyone finds it, I'll be doomed. Lord Kube will show no mercy. A lost key. <gasps> I heard a door. I'm fucked. No! Oh my god! No, 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 no. Oh, drink. Oh. Fuck, she's got me. No, 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 no. Gross. Just do it. Yeah, I... That's messed up. Firewood, yes. Okay. Okay. Just gotta be mega careful. <gasps> there she is. She was walking down the stairs. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Hell yes. Pincers to pull out nails. So we got pincers to pull out nails. Key. 
Okay. <gasps> oh, oh, oh. This bitch. Holy crap. Is that her jumping up? Okay, nice. I know where this is, I think. Oh, nice. Found it. Another journal. On the day I left my sister Anyo behind and descended the mountain alone, I was certain she would follow me. I anticipated her tearful apology as she had done countless times before, but Anyo never had returned. Why did I let go of her hand? If only we had gone down the mountain together, hand in hand, Anyo would still be my, by my side. I lost her due to my shallow jealousy. I've started to cry. I've cried and lived in sorrow for days, and now I've run out of tears. I will never let it go again. Dang, son. Again. Spade. Used for digging. Okay. Oh, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Fuck! Let me go! No! No, 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 no. Fuck! Oh, what's in here? This is a new way. Oh, fuck, man. I'm so on edge. I can't even speak. Lord Kube ordered me to hide away the mulberry crest displayed on the la altar. The red mulberry crest has been con has been hidden near the shrine, while the blue mulberry crest is buried near next to the stone lantern in the courtyard. 
That serene yet sorrowful expression left me with a sense of unease. Since then, your Lord Kyuubei has vanished without a trace. Shrine. Stone in the courtyard. Okay. Oh, look at this. Okay. Alright, with that said guys, I think we're gonna leave it there. If you've made it this far, right, with that said though, so I think we're gonna leave it here guys. Please leave a like and subscribe, it really helps the channel. Hope you enjoyed. And yeah, have a good one. And yeah, thanks Bye. for watching. Have a good one. Bye.